Eddie Firestone Jr., who played Sonny the Office Boy from 1946 to 1948 in the earlier comedic Let George Do It episodes, was an extremely popular character actor who appeared in hundreds of radio shows, TV shows, and movies beginning in the 1940s. Firestone was born on December 11, 1920 in San Francisco, California. He played two title roles during his early radio career. He was the first actor to play Joey Brewster in the old radio hit That Brewster Boy from 1941 to 1945. He later played the title in Harold Teen, a far less successful situation comedy. He followed this with roles in many of the radio-based soap operas, including Hawthorne House, One Man's Family, Vic and Sade, Mary Marlin, and Woman in White. With the advent of television, Firestone was able to find lots of work opportunities and a long TV career. His many credits included Dragnet, Disneyland, Dobie Gillis, Dick Van Dyke, Perry Mason, The Fugitive, The Big Valley, Hogan's Heroes, The Rockford Files, and Dallas. He will perhaps be best remembered for playing Hap in the 1960s Western series Gunsmoke. Firestone made his film debut with a minor role in The Jackpot in 1950. His other main movie credits included Good Morning, Miss Dove, 1955, The Great Locomotive Chase, 1956, Joe Butterfly, 1957, The Mountain Road, 1960, Two for the Seesaw, 1962, Panic in the City, 1968, Duel, 1971, and The Stone Killer, 1973. Firestone died of respiratory and heart failure in Sherman Oaks, California, on March 1, 2007, at the age of 86. He is buried at the Pierce Brothers Valhalla Memorial Park in North Hollywood. For Old Time Radio Researchers, I'm Alicia Williams, your announcer.